to eastward. This doesn't look like a monster at all. Must be some weird rock formations. Oh, that explains it. Oh, hey! Ruby! Who's this? Oh, you know, just an old buddy. She's in cahoots with the hero. Cahoots, huh? Ruby, I'm in cahoots with everyone. You're all my special little buds. I don't pick favorites. I don't like her. What happened here? A big fight. Between Audrey and some monsters, I mean. Me and Audrey are still cool. <laughs> it was crazy. The monsters were all like, blah, 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 rah. And Audrey was all like, swing, zap, kapow. She's just so cool. She seemed to say big time. I think now they're celebrating with her. Oh, great. So she's here. Why well, y'all get to hang out more? I don't think I want to see her. She sucks. She's really not that bad. Once you get to know her, at least. But okay, I'm out. I'm just zoning out here. Didn't expect to see ya. But, um, but hey, good luck. On the whole Earth Song thing. She definitely did. But she's being too cool to notice. <laughs> Joke's on her. While she's getting busy fawned on, we can go straight to the king. Deliver your silly message. And then get a head start on the real quest. End of the world, overseer song, remember. Sounds like a plan? Yeah! Ooh, pet the deer dog. Or deer wolf. She had to have palace up this hill. Oh, let's grab all the butterflies. Over this way. Hey, I'm sitting here. You want something? Everyone's so uppity about this hero gal. Not me. Don't give a crap. As soon as somebody's that popular, I get kind of suspicious, you know? Nobody's that good. She's a giant phony has to be. If she was a real hero, maybe she'd end this stupid war. This goes on and on and on and on and on. 
Who has time for this crap? I'm just gonna enjoy my spot. You do that, Steve. the lodge workers are also celebrating the hero. People in the city treat foreigners like a disease. It's cruel. I hate it. I came a long way to be safe from the war. Here I'm an outsider. With the monsters attacking the town, I guess it's not safe either. Can't believe Shandes would really send giants. They're way bigger than those little guys in the forests. But hey, this whole conflict is crazy. I think we all want it to be over. I'm sick of this hot weather. Terrible for my skin, too. You can buy something if you want, by the way. You don't seem like a jewelry type. I'm catching some sun. Sun's good for your Wandra. So warm. It feels right, you know. I found a great place to catch the sun. High up and sat in the desert far from here. If you find it, well, I better not say. It's for you to discover. There are a million, billion, billion suns like ours. But ours is special to us because it gave us life. And it gives more every day. Just gives and gives and gives. We're so lucky to have that. Humans aren't like the sun. Sometimes we give and sometimes we have to take too. When we feel lost or sad, I think the sun's there to remind us it ain't all bad. And it's always there, reminding us. Even when we can't see it behind the clouds. Can you go get him or something? Absolutely not! In case you haven't noticed, we are at war. It's my sole duty to protect the, protect the king from harm. So we are not allowing anyone in or out at this time. Especially not any witches. What? That's ridiculous, nobody! What about you? Don't you, you don't go in or out? Obviously we make some exceptions. We invited the hero for a special visit. But unless you are of a caliber, no way, sister. Ah. Her. 
Of course it's her. However, you can feel free to enjoy the exquisite castle garden. Oh, sure. I'm gonna just ravish your stupid garden. Can't get enough. Maybe I'll eat all your stupid trees and flowers. Because they are so exquisite. We should go, Miriam. Yeah, sure. Gah! I can't believe this. What do we do now? Um... Well, we could forget about your ghost message. No, we can't do that. Good on the water, Miriam. We can't quit yet. Well... Then we can talk to your good buddy, the hero. No, definitely not that either. Those are the choices. I think we should focus on finding the Overseer song. But you do you. I like the hero. She's so cool. She's like the coolest, strongest girl in the whole world. Wow. I hear she's singing in Xiatian at the lodge. Like a normal person, so humble. Good day, citizen. Everything in order? Seen anything or anyone suspicious in the city? Don't hesitate to come to me if so. Even if it's someone you know, okay? The military's here to keep us all safe. Everyone's excited about the hero in town, aren't they? Even if she wasn't here, we could have stopped those monsters. I just want to make sure you know that. Shatian is the safest place in the world. But we appreciate her help, of course. Us soldiers are all huge fans of the hero, too. We're interested in working with her to keep the city safe. I haven't gotten to meet her yet. But I really would like to. I'm not from around here, are you? I hate to say it, but your clothes are disgusting. When's the last time you washed them? Where on earth have you been wearing that? Where on earth have you been to wearing that? My buddy Bo is in the military. It's a pretty raw deal. Dad has a lot of money, so I'm lucky. I don't have to enlist or anything. I hope Bo can get out of it somehow. It's kind of hard being young these days. You can make plans about what a job you kind of want to have kind of job you want to have. But once you get to a certain age, you might just get put into the war. And all those plans go out the window. Not really hopeful. I mean, I'm lucky, but... Hello. Are you interested in any potions? I made them all by myself. The science behind it is very interesting. I source all of my ingredients from nature, and I apply knowledge from chemistry to make new concoctions. The potions are high quality. They produce consistent results. You should buy some. That sounds fun. I don't have any money though. Oh. I'm grateful to be alive here. I came from Lumbertown, the forest. Oh, I was there. Really? Still there? I've been worried for them. Especially with monsters reaching the gate here. I thought... Well, good that they're okay. So they're alright? Yes. Basically, there's still lots of monsters here. Monsters there. I was with a friend who could fly, so we got out. But we couldn't bring anyone. I see. We've been trying to petition this king to send help, but... It hasn't been fruitful. Hero led a big band of us from here from the town. It was very heroic. It's nice, you know. Having a hero to come help you in a situation like that. I could get used to it. Only our king was so compassionate. The Shandish are crazy! 
Take it from me, youngster. I was married to one. They learn all kinds of wacko magic over there. Don't trust them. They have a full head, full head of hair. My Shandish wife took it all from me when she left. With her magic. That's the kind of wackos they are, youngster. Don't use spells for any, any pe old petty thing. You ask me, this war's gone for too, too many years. We should have crushed those witches by now. It's an awful thing, war. Someone's gonna fight up the evil out here. Don't interrupt me right now. I'm thinking. My girlfriend said something very strange to me earlier. I just can't figure out what she meant. Did I do something wrong? Is she going to dump me? I can't figure it out. I wish I could talk to my kin about this. I think she understands girl much better than I do. Did you see the hero? She was here earlier. She's so cool. I think she went to the lodge. So she's staying here! I want to meet her so bad. That was so scary when the Shandas monsters came. And then the hero just killed those bad guys. I can't believe she's real. And she's here in town at the lodge. You think she can really shoot lightning? I heard she has a magical dash move too. And a cool sword. I'm pretty sure this is not intentional. <gasps> Welcome to my humble caravan. I hope you'll buy something. I have all kinds of plants and bugs and sca I scavenge the wilderness. Oh, I don't have any money. Oh, me neither. Nobody wants to do business with a panda. Are you really a panda? Yes! I travel all over the world with my caravan. No people here don't trust a talking red panda. See, they love animals, but they don't love me. I think you're neat. Ooh, thank you kindly. Truthfully, times are tough now. I have to sell my horse here for money. And I yearn for the open road again. Have you ever lived in the wilderness? There's nothing better for me. The smell of trees, the sound of rain on the roof of my caravan. To be honest, I've grown to love human food. I guess that's partly why I started needing money. She. Guys, the desert to get here was very tough. It was hot all in all my fur. I almost ran out of food. There's not as much to scavenge in the desert. But I'd heard about the beautiful city on the other side. My spirit adventure, I couldn't say no. Now I'm trapped here. It's not easy. No matter what, I always keep a smile on. Things will turn around. is. Ain't he the cutest, greatest. We've been together all my life now, you know. If you can't tell, that's a heckin' long time. Ha! <laughs> Stuff to make an old gal a bit teary-eyed. Yet to my age, sure not this reminisce about the old days. War's been gone, going forever, but 
Feels like it wasn't so bad back then. And again, feels like everything was better back then. Ha! <laughs> but don't look like you got a kid of your own. Let me tell you, it's a special thing. The companion has been there as long as you can remember. I don't ever leave your side. It's better than family. Better than my family, anyways. Heh. <laughs> Careful, chump. Me and my kin are the strongest in Jiantan. Oh my gosh. You make an animal friend fight? Uh, not really. It's just a game we play with the other kids. So the hero's in town. Is she pretty tough? She doesn't even have her own kin. I was gonna find her in the lodge later. And challenge her to a duel! My mom won't let me though. There was this really cool show that came through town. About a hero and his kin partner. He would fight evil sorcerer bad guys together. They were like telepathic and super in sync. And really, really strong. I want to be like that. Hey, my kin are training up. We could compete in our school sports team this year. Now to go all the way to nationals. I'm so grateful for my kin, Yoshi. He's a trusty friend. And he keeps my lap nice and cozy too. I always keep Yoshi very close to me. I feel so relaxed without him around. With him around. Once when I was a kid, I was separated from my parents. I was so scared, but Yoshi made me feel okay. I started howling until my parents found us. He's a smart little boy. Getting in and out of rules gotten challenging as the war escalated. Are you from outside rule? How'd you get in? Oh, you had to bust your way through the border wall, didn't you? Ah. <laughs> The look on your face. I'm only joking, you know. Friends of communist. The old meetings. I can't afford to go to those. I don't have diddly squat. But it's not about having what you want. It's wanting what you got. I'm gonna soak up the sun. And remind everyone to lighten up. It's when you feel down. You really got no one to blame but yourself. Maybe I'm not the king of rule, but I'm the king of me. So you don't need cash to be happy. Because, hey, sun's free. Huh, yeah. Uh, if I go too fast, it's just gonna throw me in front of the lodge. Weird. I don't know why, but I feel worried almost all the time. Back. I wish I could just turn it off. Maybe it's the war. Maybe not. Shandesh really scare me. I know they all use magic and stuff. I don't want people like that as an enemy. Did you see the giant monsters they sent here? Someone told me they ate anything and everything. Plants, rocks, animals, walls, houses. People. Even when I forget about the war, I still feel terrible. Like something bad is coming. And big. Sometimes the feeling is especially bad. The only thing that shakes me out of it is talking to my mom. She's the best. What are some funny clothes? You're on Shandesh, are you? Sorry, I'm military, I'm so I'm supposed to ask. I don't really care. This war with Shanda has been going my entire life. I really don't care about it. As long as we don't die, I guess. The military's a bit of a drag, but you get benefits for it. And staying in the city is easy. Nothing ever reaches here. Well, except for those giant monsters. But then the hero just took care of it herself, so... Whatever. The scary thought is... Since Monster didn't make it to here, are you going to make it here again? What if the hero was not here that time? It's a lot to worry about, when it gets to be that much. I'd rather just not think about it.
Blue, yes, yes. Welcome to our humble inn. I don't know if you're aware, but the hero is staying with us. So please be on your best behavior. We would very much like to have an endorsement. Yes, yes. If the hero gives us a glowing review, then surely we'll be overrun with guests. Times have been hard with the war, you see. Rule does not take many visitors these days. Also, if you are bringing a kin in, please make sure to clean up after them. We've gotten many complaints of untidy rooms. Fine, we'll talk to the hero. Well, well, well. If it isn't my favorite bard and witch. I didn't know you two were in town. That's crap, we walked right by you earlier. Did you? Well, what's shaking? You want to meet the king. A rule? Yeah, guess he's playing pretty low these days. You'd have to be pretty important to meet him. Yeah, we get it. Why do you get to meet the king? Sheesh, all this attitude. For your information, I saved the city from a giant monster attack. And... I need to learn the Overseer song from the king. Important saving the world business, you know? The king knows the Overseer song. We need that too! You do? Oh, yeah, I guess that makes sense. How else would you keep breaking into the spirit world? Tell you what. I'll help you both out. Really? Sure. I'll bring you along to my meeting later. I could use a couple flunkies. Flunkies! I mean, I don't have to bring you. No, 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 we'll do it. Ugh, cool. But hey, listen. Since I'm doing you both such a huge favor, I could use one from you too. Like what? Nothing too hard. <laughs> I need to get a potion of power from the local shop. Can you pick one up for me? It would be really be a huge help. You know, if you wanted to tag along later. Thanks, you're the best. Hey, you didn't forget what I needed, did you? Maybe... It's a potion of power. It's a potion. Shop in the town probably sells it. Thanks, you're a lightsaber. So you're good at seeing, right? It's very nice. What are the kinds of gear you got? Gear? Yeah, like weapons. I don't have that kind of stuff. What? You mean you just, just do singing? I'm a bard. Sheesh. I always assumed you were at least like an archer or something. Crazy that you even got this far. Yeah, it is very buggy around this area specifically. 